there's no easy way to say this, guys. I am extremely, extremely disappointed in all of you. Honestly, no cap. So yesterday, I did a poll on my YouTube channel, and I said, which do you prefer? I put two options there. I put tacos and hamburgers. 40,000 people voted in 10 hours, and the winner so far is hamburgers. This is not okay. This is horrible. This ruined my day. <laughs> oh my god, I just can't believe hamburgers are winning over tacos. But anyways, I guess it is what it is. You guys hate me. You guys are 100% racist. Come <laughs> <laughs> so I was on my favorite subreddit r slash cringe and we have a few clips to go through not gonna lie it's pretty painful I almost gave up on my whole YouTube channel one video in so please strap in grab your hot Cheetos grab your Takis grab whatever snack you have nearby and get ready because we're going to cringe a lot <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get started with the first one. This video says the face of her mother says it all. Let's just give it a watch. Stranger. You can tell the mom is extremely disappointed. <laughs> She's dead inside. She's destroyed. I know that I would. Imagine you're chilling watching TV with your husband or wife. And your daughter, your 16, 17, 18 year old daughter says, Yo, mom, can you come upstairs for a second? Just, it'll just take five seconds, mom. I promise. She takes you to the bathroom and she tells you, Mom, can you record me making funny anime sounds? And while you're at it, can you please invite your new boyfriend that you just met a week ago? Tell John to come on to help me so he can be part of the family. Imagine you're dating this girl's mom. And the first thing she does after the day, she's like, yeah. Yeah, my daughter says if you want to help her record some funny anime noises because we are bullshit. <laughs> now, I like anime as much as the next guy, but this is why some people bully anime watchers. And I don't blame him, honestly. You're legitimately scared to say you like anime because people who don't watch anime think everyone's like this. <laughs> when it's not the case, not all of us are this fucking cringe. Why would you invite your mom? Don't you have a tripod? Hell, you don't even need a tripod. Grab some gel. Be careful. Make sure it says gel jail make sure it doesn't say gorilla glue literally grab anything you have so you can put your phone there so you can hold it you don't need your mom and yeah the mom is disappointed she's like Ugh, she's not going to college is she she's going to be a youtuber <laughs> <laughs> She's going to become an influencer. Man, I hate that word with passion. Now, from 1 to 10, I'll give that an 8. Not gonna lie, I almost deleted this video out of pure cringe. <laughs> I'm sorry you guys had to see that, but it is what it is. Tell me in the comments below, what would you do if this was your daughter? Would you send her to the street or would you help her out? Because I know you, I mean, everyone knows what I would do. <laughs> Some people were saying, mom's BF in the back is like WTF. Someone responded with, he's like, thank God that's my biological offspring for sure. You could just tell this guy is not her real dad this is his stepdad maybe his fourth or fifth or maybe it's just the mom's new boyfriend it was the first time coming over for dinner the girl was upstairs they were just chatting in the couch for all we know this couple was binge watching some sensitive society bangers i mean that could be the case so they were just chilling and the girl was like mom stepdad just come on here check me out <laughs> i'm a tiktok celebrity just record me making dumb faces and cringe anime sounds someone said if i would do this and my mom was next to me i would get this own someone said i'll get it beaten out of me i would have trashed myself 100% if a day ever comes that I'm in the bathroom and I get the idea to make the world's cringiest TikTok and I say yo mom can you help me here I'll be like you know what mom I just I just let myself out <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for wasting your time. Someone else said, why though? Like, why do this exactly? Think about it. She sat down. She grabbed her phone. She thought about it. She was like, you know what will make me viral? Let me make dumb faces with anime noise. Yeah, that should make me the next Charlie D'Amelio. <laughs> Oh my god, it hurts my brain. I just, I, I have to move on. This is just too fucking cringe. Let's get into the next video, shall we? Because this, this is getting pretty bad. <laughs> now this video says, lost my memory prank on my boyfriend. And by the emojis, you could just tell this is one of the funniest videos y'all will ever see. Um, so let's just watch it, shall we? Ready to rock and roll? <laughs> Well, that was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. You just can't see me. I'm smiling from cheek to cheek. My face hurts because of how much I'm laughing at this. I'm laughing. I'm laughing. I love it. Um, yeah, this was fucking trash. The faces. The faces this girl made would make anyone want to punch their $2,000 PC. Just, uh, just like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, just, 
Let me punch my screen. Yes, I have anger issues. I don't know about you guys, but to me, that was one of the funniest pranks I've ever seen. Honestly, you gotta love how at the end she's like, babe, <laughs> babe, silly me. I mean, why do you leave? It's not like I screamed at you, made stupid faces, made faces that only two year olds laugh at. I mean, babe, come on. <laughs> why are you mad at me? What did I do wrong? <laughs> yeah, this girl's cringe. And if she was my girlfriend, I mean, first of all, that's fake. YouTubers don't have girlfriends. But in theory, if I had a girlfriend and she did this, I would break up with her immediately. There's no way I'm handling someone this fucking annoying. I just hate people like this. And the faces she made, what the fuck was that with her jaw? It felt like it was... <laughs> It felt like it was disconnected. She low-key, low-key looked like the Muppet. You know what I'm talking about? This Muppet right here. It's just not funny, dude. And I get it. Comedy subjective. But I'm pretty sure no one here, I legitimately think no one laughed at this. Maybe it was an awkward laugh, but no one said, <laughs> Yes, queen, you made me laugh. Someone says she got the mouth of Beaker from the Muppets. That's what I'm saying. That's what, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. What the fuck was that face? Jesus Christ. Same thing, man. I've never seen a face move that way. I was low-key scared. I legitimately thought her head was going to fucking explode. This person said she looks like the kind of girl who eats a banana sideways. You know what, dude? I could see it. <laughs> I could definitely see it. This person said that will be an instant breakup for me. I think it will be for anyone. I just couldn't tolerate that. Holy shit, can you imagine? And I'm sure this is one of those couples who have hoodies that said my queen and my king. I think I've had enough cringe for today. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Like the video if you liked it. Turn on notifications. And if you can, please consider becoming a channel member. That's 99 cents. And while we're talking about channel members, I just want to thank my channel members for the continued support. I just appreciate everyone here. Seriously, I know you say it, but seriously, thank you so much for the support lately. It's insane. <laughs> I'm extremely lucky to be where I'm at, and I'm extremely thankful for it. So thank you very much for getting me to this position. I appreciate all of you. They've excused me. I want to go fucking throw up because these TikToks are hella cringe. And um, my pizza's out of the oven, so I got to run, guys. See ya.